Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up a Vue.js project and how to install, implement and customize Bulma. Let's jump right into creating the project. I have a terminal open and the first thing we can do is to create the project. We do this by typing view create Bulma demo. Bulma demo will be the name of this project. I want to manually select which features to use. I need Babel and I need the CSS preprocessors. Linter I don't need for this project and not any of the else either. And hit enter. I want to use CSS slash CSS and I want to use dedicated config files. Now that the project is created I can go into the full folder and I can install Bulma. I do this by running npm install Bulma. Perfect. Now we can run the project just to see that everything is working. npm run serve. Then I can copy this URL and open it in my browser. Everything is working, so then I can remove this boilerplate code and add some Bulma elements. First I can open the code here in Atom. And in app.view I remove this CSS and I can import Bulma here, like that. And then I can remove this line and this line and the content here. And I can insert a button from Bulma. Give the class of button is primary. This is a button and save. So if I go back to the browser, there is a button from Bulma which has its style. Importing the CSS like this might not be the best solution, so I want to import the SCSS files first. So I can just remove this entire tag here. And inside of assets, I create a new file, main.s CSS, enter. And in here I import the Bulma. I don't need anything more than Bulma slash Bulma because this will point to the SCSS files from Bulma. So I can save and go back to main.js and import or require the file here. So just say require dot assets main dot css and save. If I go back to the browser again now, it's still working as it should. Let's say I wanted to customize the Bulma variables. I can go into my main dot css file and over the import I can say primary blue and save. Then the primary color for Bulma will be blue. And that's basically how you can customize Bulma. All the variables you want to customize, you add over this import and they will be converted inside here. You can basically do this with all of the other CSS frameworks too, like Bootstrap and Foundation. I hope you liked this video and if you want more like this, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel.